Hey guys, it's me Adam and we are here going to do some altering Do some, actually I'm, I'm going to do a cheap contact hardening shadow You might know that, is that what I call it? It's a uh, ray tree shadow You know that shadow is, is really sharp at the beginning and goes wash away at the end. You can need an expensive rendering technique, but we are going to alter it. Uh, right here we have a simple directional light. We have a swirl and we have a surface. Same surface. Um, let's render this once more. See that before. Now, what you need to do is just rotate, not rotate, but you know that light is not a single source. Light delivers photons, ton, tons of photons. They they actually have billions of like so how simulate that is. I'm just going to duplicate this and rotate some of it, distort some of it. When you distort it like this, you're actually going to get some double shadows. This is what we are here for. It's sharp at the beginning and getting some kind of. So we are going to lower the sensitivity, intensity, I mean, of the light itself. We need to get it really much, maybe by zero point. one or two so it's going to eliminate really off and we're going to duplicate it really often duplicate 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 and rotate it's very extremely little bit And see how it goes right now. I wonder if it is going to get ugly. No, skills cannot. Now, now that's kind of nailed it. <laughs> so that's kind of it. With a lot, that's. Basically, the theory. I think that's pretty much it. Or maybe you can just double some directional lighting and then just blur it out, and you got to be the blur a little at the beginning and getting blurred a lot at the end. So, I guess that's pretty much it. Let's render this one more time. And we are actually done here. Ah. You folks get out here. We're done. Thank you for watching.